Hey everyone, welcome to the video of the week. Today's video of the week is 15 NXT superstars that I want to see in WWE 2K19, which um, is a hot topic right now because this is usually around the time that they start to speculate um, who's going to be in the game, who and what's going to be new in the game, or etc. So I thought I would start my uh, predictions for the game by... Uh, giving you guys 15 NXT superstars that I want to see a part of the 2K19 game for WWE. So let's get started. Um, 1, 2, and 3 kind of go together, um, but before I get into it, I want to say that none of these characters are from NXT actually appeared in 2K18 or any previous games um, besides as like a downloadable content person off of the online section of community creations so that is why I decided to do it this way anyways one two and three as I stated kind of go together and they are the undisputed era aka Adam Cole Bobby Fish and Kyle O'Reilly now I think that having them in the NXT um, is a fantastic thing and um, they are definitely one of the best groups or stables in NXT currently and it would be a great addition to the 2K19 game to have them in the game making this the first game um, in WWE for all three of them to appear in um, number four and number five kind of go together which is Andrade Cien Almas and Selena Vega. Now, I know what you guys are thinking. If you guys watched SmackDown Live on Tuesday, you might be saying, well, they're on the main roster now. They're not NXT. Well, if you remember, Andrade Cien Almas and Cien, aka Cien, or, and Selena Vega have never appeared in a WWE game. So, I'm probably assuming that they would put them underneath the NXT roster. So that is why I've added them as a part of the NXT portion of this. And I, I think that they would be great additions to the game um, nevertheless. Number 8 is Kairi Sane, the Pirate Princess of NXT. I think that she would be a great addition to the game because she would be like the way to bring in the Mae Young Classic winner into it. Um, and with her winning the Mae Young Classic, that's already making history um, in the world of WWE. So to make even more history, make this the first game for her. Um, number seven um, is Candice LeRae. Now, Johnny Gargano is actually already in the WWE series. Um, he's in 2K18, and I hope and pray that he will still remain in the game. However, I would love to see Candice LeRae in the game as well, which is obviously Johnny's wife. Um, but I think having her in the game would be quite interesting because... Imagine yourself being able to play as Candice LeRae against some of the greats, like legends. Number eight is Shayna Baszler. Now, um, she's not the best uh, light NXT woman athlete currently, but she, you can't deny that she is one of the most dominant. And... I think that having her in the game would give people the potential to not only be her in the game and show their um, dominance in the game, but also be able to possibly even fight her in the game against whomever you want. I think that's the fun part of having a WWE video game. Number nine is the Velveteen Dream. Now. I'll be honest with you, um, I'm not the biggest fan of the Velveteen Dream, personally, but I can't deny that he is a fantastic athlete, and um, I honestly think that fans are starting to get behind him a lot, and he's really proven himself to the fans in the WWE itself, so I think it would be perfect to add him into the WWE 
uh, gaming franchise. Number 10 is Ricochet. Now, Ricochet is someone that I don't know if they'll actually add or not, being the fact that um, he did come in fairly recently to the WWE, but um, anything's possible, maybe a DLC guy, um, but I would love to see Ricochet take a part in the WWE gaming. Number 11 is Dakota Kai. Now, Dakota Kai is a female athlete on NXT as well. Um, and currently, she's in kind of like a storyline with Shayna Baszler. Um, I think that having her in the game and Shayna in the game would be amazing because you can play as either one and continue the storyline and rivalry yourself. Number 12 is EC3. Now, another one of these guys that fairly recently came in, and I don't know if he'll actually take part in the game, but it would be great to see him take part in the WWE video game as EC3. Number 13 is the UK champion Pete Dunne. Now, um... At first, I didn't really care for Pete Dunne, I'll be honest with you, but he's starting to warm up on me, but I can say that he is one fantastic athlete and a heck of a wrestler, and he would be a heck of an addition to the WWE franchise in the game. Number 14 and 15 kind of go together as well, and they are the tag team known as Mustache Mountain, also two members of the UK division. And they are Trent Seven and Tyler Bate. Now Tyler Bate being the winner of the UK uh, tournament for the UK championship originally and also being the first ever UK champion, I think he would be a great addition to the game because of this. Now you can't have one mustache mountain guy without the other so that is why i wanted to add trend seven because trend seven himself is also a fantastic athlete and he would make a great addition to the game as well but i know i said only 15 but i did actually add two more um and that is war raiders war raiders is a new tag team in nxt um they debuted very frequently you might know them better as war machine but I think it would be great to see them take part in the WWE video game. Me personally, I am a fan of them. I've been a fan of them since before they came into the WWE. So it would be great to be able to play as them actually in the WWE franchise in gaming. So that's going to end out this week's video of the week. I hope you guys liked the choices that I've said in the NXT superstars I wish would be debuting in their gaming form in WWE 2K19. So um, leave a comment in the section below um, if you guys agree on some of these. If you guys thought I missed out on someone that you guys want in the game, leave in the comment section below. Um, and have a great day. But before I end this out, next Sunday's video of the week is 25 girl and boy names that I like. This is the second time I did this, but I want to... Uh, con extend the brand because um people really liked it the last time so have a great day peace and have a great and bye